So I was out in Picayune Strand State Forest the other day, and I thought I would share with you guys some of the things that I saw. Here's a stand of pine trees, and at the bottom of those trees I found some pine cones. Pine cones are where pine trees make their seeds. Those pine cones fall down to the ground, the seeds come out of the cone, and they start to grow. Now here's some pine seedlings. Seedlings are really baby pines. They're low to the ground. Notice how they've got green needles, just like the adults, the big ones that we saw. You can't really see the trunk, but if we get in really close, you can just start to see a little bit of the trunk right in the middle there. See that? Kind of brown and gray. Now here's some saplings. These are a little bit older. They're starting to grow up straight and tall now and spread out into branches. You'll see that the needles are still green. They're the same color. There's the trunk. Look at the old trunk on the baby one, the seedling, and now the new trunk on the saplings that's getting bigger, starting to split into branches higher up in the tree. See those branches spreading out? And notice the bark on the trunk. It's very rough. It's really kind of gray in color. Now the needles are all the way out at the end of the branch. Very straight green needles. They're kind of rough when you feel them. Now here are those adults. Here's that stand of pine trees again. Here's a big adult pine tree. This one's all grown up. The branches are way above where I can reach them. The pine needles are way out at the tip. They look the same as the babies. But look, now there's pine cones up in that pine tree. This is an adult pine tree. It's able to make new pine trees. Look at that bark now. It's even rougher. It's gotten very thick. It's still gray in color. You can see a little bit of brown in there. Notice that it's split. Parts of it come off e easily. That's to help it survive fires. Now there's those pine cones again, way up high in the tree. When they fall to the ground, the seeds will come out and we start all over again with new. So that's how the, the young offspring trees look similar to the saplings and the adults and how they're different too.